Hello everyone, Son of Beast here. The second game is about to start for the New York Rangers and Pittsburgh Penguins. The Rangers are in the lead 1-0 over the Penguins. Game 1 is definitely a best matchup here. But now, I have something better than OJ. I'm good like to say, I'm giving it off to Meatphone. Hey though, how are you doing there? Thanks for bringing me in the game. Remember for the NBA? Yeah, of course. As always, it's just amazing to see how this matchup turns out by the rival in between the East Coast of the Rangers and Pittsburgh Penguins. This is all that we have definitely done here before since, since the early regular seasons as well. Yeah, of course it is, but I think this might be turning out even more better than we can have here before. And if you're tuning in to the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports, we keep watching this one as we have some more games coming underway here in the first round before the teams move on in the second round to win four games in each series. One player of the team, one team will move on and the other team will be eliminated from the Eastern and Western Conference. It's going to be a lot of work out there, but there is much more that we have to face it from here. Now, let's head you over to the Garden to start the presentation of the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs. Game 2, Pittsburgh and New York. It's a great evening here at the Madison Square Garden. With me and me phone, it's time for the second game of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. Penguins and Rangers are set for the opening face-off here in Game 2. New York has their puck in transition, and we are underway here in New York City. The Rangers will play on the attack here on offense, as they will start things here in the first period. Loose quickly over to Lindgren. Takes a wrist shot. That goes off and saved me by Jerry. Jerry has it all on the board. And with the starting goalies, we have Jerry here in a plane here for the Penguins. And the other hand is Igor Shesterkin. Made some great saves out there, just a bit. Most of the time, it was much better than he had played. Now here's Schnetzel, as he has a uh, Pittsburgh in the ever transition. Stop by the goaltender. Kreider moves to Lafreniere. Around the boards, chips off to Kreider. Kreider to Fox. And he misfires as he will have to restart from, from the other end. Up around the board gets knocked away here from Pittsburgh. Who's off to Savannah Chad? That pass gets broken up. Plays around the board and goes right off to Panarin. Since the last game, they already have played here in the first game of the season as they already won against the Pittsburgh part of game one. It was 1-0 for the Rangers. Of course it is. Most of the time, it's just quite even a better uh, better timing. And one of it all it takes, it just goes right into the uh, position. They help us move and keep it inside the, by the puck. So it definitely gives them good, uh, good help here to make it strong and feel like a comfortable in position. Truba back to Miller. Moving back to Truba is getting off target again. And he will have to switch it again. Moves it quickly to over to Goodrow. Right to Panarin. He's inside. Stop by the goaltender and it's safety by Jerry. Miller on the outside. Shoots. Saved by Jerry with the glove save. That's a great intense. With all the uh, matches that turns to be here, it was all that Jerry had picked up here on offense. And for that time, the defense has already picked up the glove, glove save. Pittsburgh has tossed up at the faceoff win. Where it goes. And the attack goes offside of the firing. Jones moves over to the heel. Hadel gets squeezed. And it's Damala with the with the stop. Carter with the ball. Uh, he's all alone. Stop by the goaltender and Shusterkin. Oh, good pass here. One on two tricks here for Shusterkin. Most of all of his time, it can be a lot much harder than he had. But that's a great help here with the communication they have. Jones 
right to Gunner. And they will force the regroup here as the puck is grabbing out of play here off the neutral zone. Schneider right into the puck. The Rangers are attacking here on offense to pick up steam. Here's Carter. Shoots. Saved by Shostokin. We only have a few minutes before reaching the halfway point mark here in the first period as the score is still even. Pittsburgh has it all locked. Oh, McKay is making a body check. Pushes back on the offense to the neutral zone. Schnetzel, saved by Shesterkin. Shesterkin got a good piece of it at that point. That puck is going to be a lot of hard uh, to try to work their way on the attack. That's what they give him with their best uh, proper strength that they have. Stick that being left as Reeves has the puck. Dishes off to McKay. Crosby has got it into the other lane. Gets we even wrecked up in the traffic and he goes right back the other way. Off to Zabanajad. Mason has got a puck over in control for Pittsburgh to take the other lane. Here's Russ. Right on Miller. As the traffic has already been pulled back. Zibanejad with the puck. Scoots inside the neutral zone. With the wrist. Takes it off the goaltender and saved by Jerry. Fox back to Lindgren. Back to Fox. Soft shoots off the goaltender. Latang has it on the board. Pittsburgh's got it in the other lane to hit the zone. Saving off, and it goes off to shot balance. Those balance can be a lot harder in between those two players. Sometimes you're not sure what's going to go on. You might have to go quick because you're not going to have waste of plenty of time if you're looking for a puck. Play quick up. Shot is off, and it's out of play as it went up into the netting. We're just about a minute and a half to play, half minutes to play here in the first period as the score is still even. Pink Penguins take the puck in control. Panarin gets a puck of the piece and back to Lindgren. Now he just off the Fox. Oh, and a bad fire with the pass and they will have to start all over again for the top. He delivers off to Panarin. Racing attack gets knocked down. Right over to Goodrow. Goodrow with the puck. Pass off the heart. Save by Jerry. Well, oh, this has just gotten a, got a much save out there. Jerry has a lot of a strong move out there. He's got it in control. The Rangers wins the faceoff to take it back the other end. He moves quickly to Jones. Over to Hedl. Hedl gets broken up with the puck. Jones delivers it to Goffier. Moves it up in front back. And Carter going with our man Rush. Oh, how did he get there? He just got a poke check. Hedl with the attack. He's all alone. He shoots. Stop by the goaltender. Goaltender's already that quick because of how all that happened was him. It definitely did make him a one, one tough timing and get right to the other end. Hunt. Right over to back to Jones. Cruz quickly to jump. He scores. That's his first goal of the season as the Rangers take the one nothing lead. What a way to work here on offense because of what Hunt just did. This is what he has gone here before. It's his fourth goal of the season and turning out to be here with the Rangers. The Rangers have their answers here as they have to lead 1-0 in the second game of a series. Here's Crosby. Hasn't able to shoot him for the second game yet. Here's McKay. 
pushes off the board and he still has it all puck recovered. This off to Reeves. Shoot, save! Almost! It's a thin! And the referee has called it and it is no goal to be resisted on the play. Yeah, there we go. It was hit already because that was a save at that point. So at the, uh, but the uh, fans are just regretting it to make a disagreement call. And we, of course we know that Sidney Crosby, the only Hall of Famer man, might be stepping in for a next one. Also with the beauty backhand. Yes, we all have known. The day for him for himself can be the only man that he has ever played with the beauty backhand. Sometimes the players definitely gets there right in front. And the other players have it all around him. So this is why that he likes to take backhand shots or backhand pass if he's looking for the other players to open with. Lafreniere having a little hard time as the puck went out, out, of, uh, out of the box. Truba comes in there. It's Kreider with the puck. Pushes the puck right to Truba. Lafreniere with the puck. Gets stick lifted and it's Rust with the rebounding and going back over is Pittsburgh. The Penguins gets the uh, two on one attack. Just circling with a save me! And it goes right back the other way. Moves it quickly to Truba. Gets almost carried offside, but they will hold a back as they will be, uh, be forcing without the call. Moves it quickly to Reza Banajad. Back pass! And it's denied with a broken up pass. Crosby's got it in the other lane. Gets a little knockout. And it goes right over to Fox. Panera with the puck. Two on one. He scores! And it's Strome with the shot. And it's a 2 nothing lead. Nice pass here for Panera. And sometimes what Ryan Strome has done, he has hit with the goalpost, and he is going right in the angle. That was a great shot. New York has done it in the own end as they have a 2 0 lead. As uh, Panera will take the first assist and second assist here on Adam Fox. Those players can be a lot higher on the over ranking. Because of how well they played here, they have done it so much better than they have played here so far. We're under three minutes here in the first period. Panarin, puck with a drip, and it goes right back off. Guff here, back fast. This will be rounded back up in the other lane. New York's going into the offensive attackment here in the neutral, neutral zone. Frox, passing with the puck. Gives a little tip off, and there's going to be a lot of Call calls here to try to trip over someone. Yeah, we, we talked about that one here. Most of them, they get eight, they really have a hard time to try to face him off with the attacker. Not just going to be him for him tonight, but there might be anybody else that might be going forward to stop the man to try to knock them down and making them hurt. McCain with the puck and a rub around. Stopped by the goaltending on just Sturkin off the pad. Shot wide. And we're down to a last minute left here in the first period. Rodriguez gets it over again, and it's now changing back to the Rangers facing into the neutral zone. Rooney right to Jones. Back to Rooney. Right to Schneider. Back to Jones. Gets a little stop by the, uh, by the defensive player. Rodriguez right into the attack. The catch stops the puck. Five seconds to shoot. Reeves in the attack. He goes in. Stopped by Jerry. As the horn sounds, it's the end of the first period. It's the Rangers hitting two goals in this first period. And we'll be right back after this message. Second period to start here for the second game as we are underway here to start things off. Pittsburgh Penguins starting things off here in the second period and we all feel ready to go. 
Penguin suddenly mirror their tense of timing to hit them to hit them with another rebounding effort on offense. Gets a little body check here. A lot of great work, hustle on the defense. Pass broken up. Fixing a rebound here is on, on Schnitzel. He's facing inside. Pass to Demolipin. Open the pack. Oh, he goes off wide balanced. Lafayette with the puck. Two of one. And no chance here. Lindgren gets the puck. Defensive is putting a pressure on him for the Pittsburgh to try to stop by. They always do. When the player gets there tough, you just gotta, you can't just like get right by it. You just gotta go right away and try to move it around a bit so nobody gets the puck right around the other lane. So you have to make it quick. Kreider with the puck. Dish off this advantage ad. Inside the paint. Goodrow that can't even to make the two on one score. Goodrow with that puck. Back to Truba. Back to Truba. Zibanejad with the puck. Back to Truba. He shoots. Goes with a broken stick and they will have to replace him with a new one. The Penguins take their offensive zone tier back into neutral zone. Hand it along. Stop by the goaltender on Sestukin. And this recarries offside as this will have to slow things down a bit. These players have a higher ranking on their on their forward position on their on their property end. One thing can, can be another one. That Sidney Crosby and the other teams has always picking up with a lot of better uh, patient gear to try to work them off. But the Pittsburgh Penguins really have got to sell things up here to try to knock them down. And a penalty is called by by Pittsburgh as this will be a first time as Kapanen will take the tripping. This time it's a New York power play as this will be right into the second period to start. Rangers wins the faceoff here as they will take the power play to take their position. Back to Miller. Truba dish off to Kreider. He shoots! Stopped by the goalie by Jari. With the time on attack here, the Rangers are picking up the steam and looking for a better offense to play on the attack zone. Pittsburgh has got their own in control. This off to Aston Race. Flings the puck around the board. New York's going in along the offensive of, uh, in, in, the, in the game. Cryer trying to hit the puck. Dish back to Truba. He goes right off to Panarin. Truba right to Mailer. Under a minute left to play for the power play. They got traffic. Latang with the puck. Goes off to Boyley. Flings the puck off to the board around the net. Panarin bish back to Cryer. New York facing any attack here on a power play. Taking a poke check. And Cryer has it all on the board. Eight seconds to play. Can there be a no one? And they will not do it here. Saved by Chari. And the power play is over for the New York Rangers. Yeah, most of the time it's it's very difficult to try to face someone in the attack group. And they're looking for a, another player to try to, to try to make their way down on the board without being pulled out to be on the defensive players. Mason this is the off to Rust. Penguins reaching back into the neutral zone to face the number check. Eight broken up. Lindgren going to face the attack. I man rush. Sunt scores. It's a three nothing game. With the one way or attacker right down when you when you come in with the uh, with the play, 
You get the two on one, and you get the man here looking from the, the corner and try to make them look tricky. But they want to make it easier to try to knock things down. The Rangers have scored their two two uh, game two goals here for the season, and nothing for Pittsburgh has come up to be out here on the other end. He bad passes off the angle as Marino takes it over. Goodsell with the ball puck. Goes in the paint and he scores! Sidney Crosby gets 25 goals of the season and the Penguins are on the board. Penguins have their regaining position here. It's a 3-1 game as a, as a shout out is no more. Yeah, because of what they have done here, this was a, bit, a better play with the pass, not even enough to try to work their way into the game. This can be a very uh, tough one if they are looking for another one to stop by. And they will have to beat the icing as no ref was blowing a whistle from the penalty out there. Russ with the puck, stick clip, stop by the goaltender, and it's saved by Sisterkin. What a great move out there. Shesterkin had it only on the board. Most of the time, it's just gone just like that. Now that's the way that they play here on offense to try to stop them. Marino right to Rust. The Penguins regain back in their neutral zone to, to face it for the third time to the fourth. Crosby with the shot, and the shot goes up by, by the goaltender. Can't beat it up. Uh-oh, this is not going to look that good for the Rangers. Yeah, you don't want to get that one in trouble because the, because the Penguins are knocking things over. They're going to need to try to like get, get a hint here to try to knock it back. Shesterkin trying to help out with Truba. Kreider right over to Panarin. With three man one, Miller back to Kreider. Back to Miller. Shoots wide, stopped by a goalie by Jari with the glove save. And this will be playing to stop things up for a brief holding moment. And with the bigger hit on the defender, he was down here before. As was Strong that was hitting up with the hit on his helmet. We're pretty we'll check him on. We'll check him out to make sure that he's okay. But we'll let them know if he's okay to be back on ice or out for the game of this one. New York with a face-off win. Breeze running over to fight it. Back to Jones. He shoots. Stopped by the Jari. And another glove save made. We're under a half a minute to play here in a second period. And it's now 3-1 lead Rangers. Now it's back to Pittsburgh to toss it up. Demolin to Hanian. He finds Capetan with the shot. Stopped by the goaltender. It's a great play to keep your eyes on the pressure here. A lot of great, a lot of great work out there. Three on one. Stopped by the goaltender. Off the pad it goes. Wow, what a save. I thought there was going to be a close call for the player to knock things down a bit. But Jari still has the puck to stop the pressure. Kreider right into the other lane. And it's almost broken up. Now it's broken up as Malkin takes it through. Coming in with the puck. Spots is blocked. Kapanen inside. Stopped by the goalie of Kisterkin. Kisterkin really has gotten uh, just a lot of a bat. A little bit of a pad off the saving mark. But that may be, may be a close call for him to try to uh, sneak things better. But now it's turning out to be just like that. Great stop by, by Sisterkin. And it's face off an icing on New York Rangers as they will have to try to stop with the play clock. New York's got their own pressure here. Going back in neutral zone is Kreider. 2 1! Stop by Jari! Another save made! Gets broken up to be hitting on the run. And we got a little fight on battle. 
This rival is the only man that gets things right into the lane. But not before then, they had it all the truth. This is all they had. New York versus Pittsburgh. The rival team of Pennsylvania and New York. Schneider dishes off to Kreider. Kreider almost gets loose to get to Benetton. Stopped by Jari with another glove save. They stop the clock at 5.22 left. 3-1 is the score. Only 20 and 17 shots in the game, as there is no uh, no even up with the 2020 run of the shots game. Fox delivering to Hunt. Marino taking a break up with the pass. Crosby's got it back in the own lane. Taking inside. Right to Ross. Pass is broken up. Rangers going back in the ever, ever end. Try to go right from height. Dish off to Shield. Hito to Lindgren. Oh, he gets knocked down. It's Netzo to stop again. Oh, the big hit. This big hit's not going to go anywhere because of all the player goes with colliding. Boom. Good you go. That means the man player gets down. Try to work it back on offense to try to stop it and try to avoid the tackle. Miller gets no shaves at all. Pedal right in over to cross. Crosby with the steal. And couldn't find Truba. Mason to Rust. Back to Marino. Crosby in along. Stop by the goalie. And it's up wide. Shooting up like it's a target off balance here. What a stop here for the, for the player to knock it down. And we got a penalty coming up for New York as it's as it's golf here with the trip. Pittsburgh Penguins Penguins will have a separation here to start their power play in a second period. New York has a higher skilling average to take the safety response. Latang over to Rodriguez. Penguins going inside the attack team in the neutral fragment zone. Carter gets trafficked and stopped by Shesterkin. Great stop here for the defenseman. They have gotten it. We got some numbers here. They're trying to work them all alone. Moves it over to Rodriguez. Rodriguez has it all in traction. Stopped by Fox. And off the pad of Goldie versus Sturkin. Good transition. They are working their way around. Not just going to be, it's not going to be very tough to if you're going to find him, man. But they have it all down. Kurbo. And they will clear the puck down for, for the regroup here of the Pittsburgh. Pass almost gets broken up. Trubo goes knocking down. This one goes to a last minute left here for the for the second period. Five seconds. Saved by Sisterkin. And the power play is over. Oh, what a stop here. What a great job by the players on defense that they had. It's a lot of higher ranking skills. They've done a lot much better than they had. Miller with a great stick lift. Rooney trying to get from, from an in clear puck. Shot is blocked. Carter with the puck. Truba to Rooney. With the shot. Stopped by the player with a shot block. The buzz beater is sounded and the second period is ended. It's a 3-1 game. Penguins are on the board here for the second period. Third period is coming up right after the break. The third period is the last one to meet. Let's get this thing going for the finishing play of game two. New York hits the face up and we are ready to finalize the last period left. Zibanejad gets a quick off right to Lafaniere. Fox gets a little bit to piece off right for the defenseman to try to knock him down. He's hurt him and all the players are getting hurt. They really have nothing else to spare from time to time. Lafaniere, he gets shot blocked and denied. 
and he goes right down. Fox, grass is broken up. Crosby in a, in a lane. Lindbergh trying to take it. And it's blocked by Fox. Fox delivering it in the offensive range. Pittsburgh is going along on again with the attack on break here to face back an offense. Strong trying to face the attacker. Pulls it back on board and it will clear the puck for, for the Penguins. Oh, it gets broken up. Oh, he went down. Miller with the puck. And it gets broken up here. Strong gets it back. Back to Goodrow. Right over to Truba. And Crosby has it sticking away. Poke check again by Miller. Goodrow with the ball. The puck to Strong. And the attacker stopped by Jari. Truba rolling back over to Goodrow. The Rangers are keeping an eyes on the players to go for open looks. Goodrow in! Stopped by the goaltender. It's Jerry with the save. Oh, those players have definitely gotten higher ranking of the of the board. They know we did have it all come down in handy, but I think there might be another way to get right by it. Malkin with the puck. And it's pass is tipped off. New York's got a long offensive offensive end now to face him up again. Trugo with the puck. Almost gets loosened, but he recovers. Inside! Cunningham blocked front by Jari. Oh, he would have been put up there soon. But it's time to make it happen to, to attack him more. Moves it over to quickly to Kreider. Kreider's all alone. He shoots! And it's off the goaltender! Two men on the man for one Carter. Try to block one, and they have it all problem, no problem here. Truba dishing off to Miller, and the pass is broken up. Rodrigo shoots, saved by Shostukin. Kreider with the puck and going back on the offensive attack. In the neutral zone, Kreider off to Lafreniere. And it passes is broken up again. As the new changes are being released, here's Mason. Goes right to Marino. Stop by the goaltender. Zibanejad with the puck. And it gets tipped away. Lavanier trying to hold on to it. And without being reset. Marino trying to come up with a better angle to make the pass. Moves it quickly to Carter. Now New York is facing another attacking on the position. Sabanajad! Oh, he just almost had him lost it, but he holds on tight. That's a great year with the play. Looks like Sabanajad almost got lost with him losing with the puck. But thanks for his saving time, he knows he can definitely try to do things again. What a stop made by Shesterkin. He has got another save on the game. And this calls to be an icing as this will be slowing down for the third period. We are just looking for another uh, attacker for the Penguins for here tonight. And they wanted to get right into it. Shot blocked! Oh, he put the body in! A lot of hits here. Wow, straight up a tangle there. That's a, that's a way wackety shot. Wackety hit. Rudy up, and he's off the board, and it's Jari with the save. Snyder, bad pass angle, and as Miller will have to try to face another attacking zone. And he gets down there. Gets uh, right to Crosby. Double end, can't find anybody. Keto almost getting, almost getting bumped up again. New York going to fight to pick some back here at offensive boards. And it's an icing called on New York as this will slow things down here now. 
There are only 21 hits here for Pittsburgh, but for nine of them, it has already been changed out here so far. Not just too much of him, but there is going to be a too much attacker that wants to try to make a, make a play. And also, they wanted to get out of the way before being knocked down by the Penguin of the boards. Lafaniere, bad angle of the pass as it's broken up again. Latang in on the neutral zone. Finds here, stopped by Sisterkin. Sisterkin's got a great save out there. He has his high, higher average career from his season of the postseason. Lafaniere dishing out the Fox. Hagen gets broken up. Oh, he's already on the board. Miller still stopping the play. Lafaniere almost went tipped out. McKay inside! Oh, there is no goal yet as he was already picked up the save. Yeah, you can see right now, it looks like the player was already in the, uh, in the crease and it looks like he was already in there. So they are not going to count that in the game. You can hear the fans that they are trying to boo with that one. That's because the ref has already made some changes here and they already had said it is a no goal. Lingering up! Slap shot! And it's Jari with a glove save! We are almost finishing here for the Stanley Cup Game 2 of the Eastern Conference of Rangers and the Pittsburgh. We will stick back here with the Western Conference as we will see the Lightnings and Toronto Maple Leafs back in Toronto for the second game. And then, they will be heading off to Tampa to play against the Lightnings. He faces offside, and that will be carried off. There are so many face-off here with the wins, it's getting a little bit close off to the end. And it's another face-off win for Pittsburgh. Heading right over, pass is broken up. New York's got a long defensive end now for the, for the attack. Strom inside, he scores! Ryan Strom, not just the only man himself that he was going right the angle, but that was an amazing slap shot on the wrist. That was a better, better angle, and Strom has definitely delivered it. Rangers have picked up 4-1 lead over the Pittsburgh Penguins, and they are leading up by three. They are really going a hard impact out there. Rangers are the fan favorite instead of New York Islanders or the Devils. Strom inside, tries again, but that went off the pad for, Le for Jari. Moza quickly over to Fox. Gets beaten up, and we got a face-off battle in here. Good row. This is back to Strom. Moves around the board to Benarin. And he won't pick up that play. Here's the odd man rush, try to face it. Try to stop in by a bad big body slam check. A little bit off the risky angle that their appointment. A little bit of, you know, a little bit out of edge work here. Yeah, of course they do. Not him, but they were already going all over the place here on ice. But there's a lot much room that they can try to able to answer things right in the upper lane. Puck gets cleared out as the icing is being called on New York Rangers. We are almost getting to the bottom of the line and only 4-1 to go here in the third. The Pittsburgh gets another win face-off win. That's blocked by Heedle. New York is putting it back on the Ranger attack fence on the neutral zone. Back to Gauthier. Lindbergh. Lindbergh gets uh, cut off as Hannon will have it off the board. 
Moreno running back over, and it's taken back off with another, with another takeaway. Goes right to Hank, right to Hedl, and it's Kapanen with a steal. Oh, he's going in. Great steal by Hedl, as this will not be the breakaway chance for Pittsburgh here. They really got their pressure on the numbers line. They, they got it all, but they have it all that they have. I mean, Rush, inside, stopped by Shesterkin. What a great save. Wow, Shesterkin was almost going to be off uh, off the target here, almost going to be uh, wicked around again, but they really know that they have it here in the offensive zone to be bringing back here to life. Pittsburgh winning again for the faceoff. Lavanier in the offensive on the attack. Slow things down and they won't be picking up here. Malkinen with the puck. Gets body checked. And that's a lot of Ranger hit with a brick. Now, of course they do. Hitting bricks can also mean that they are definitely our top man here, just like football players. We are definitely seeing things going with a slam on by. Only one minute left to play for the third period. Lafreniere with the puck. He getting the two on one. Kreider, Sabanajad, saved me by Jari. Jari really has nowhere to go focus. What a great save. Shot wide off the mark. Off the goal post, and Jari will hold the puck here to stop the clock. Rangers are making their way down to a 2-0 series in the lead here of the Stanley Cup playoffs. They're doing a lot of work here on the run. They are doing a lot of better dropping angle. They are just, just keeping it going. Set sell to Russ. Russ trying to pick up his way to steam, and it's off the pad on the boy. Reeves with the puck. Goes right into the man, almost get, gets broken up. Goes right to Demolin. Off to Gensel. And it's blocked. That means the bus sound is horn, and the Rangers wins the second game in the Stanley Cup playoffs. What a great match here. This is all that turned out to be Igor Shesterkin. His best play here in the game has turned out just like he had done before. And he's a killer to be the GOAT. Rangers are making a great win here for tonight as they will be heading to Pittsburgh here for a third and fourth game. Well, that being said, it is an uh, ex extension going on in between those players. What a great night here at the Garden. And now it's time to present your three star players of the game. This might be somebody else that, that could go for another transition in the attack. I think there might be another change up here if we're looking for, for another in, in the uh, offense and defense zone. Here's your three stars of the game. Starting off, we have number three, Mifo. His calls for Igor Shesterkin, 26 saves, 9.963 to go. With his percentage saves. The second star is Dryden Hunt. Two goals and one hit. All on his attack range with a 201, and he has all of it through. And for you, Son of Beast, number one, I have to go for Ryan Strome. Two goals in this game. Just gotten some incredible running effort. What a great play here for Ryan Strome, and he has gotten a great, great games in ahead. So that's it for this game. Me and me phone are, are good for, are all done for now, as they will, as we will be heading toward the next game here, back at the Western Conference for another matchup. Lightnings and Maple Leafs will be underway shortly after the Oilers and the Kings. There might be some other chances that might be going for the Everlane, but we may not know if there's another chance. So thank you for watching. Until next time, peace out everyone. First of all, as the NHL 22 of the Stanley Cup playoff dial.
Well, thank you so much for joining me again. I always appreciate your uh, your time, and hopefully we'll, we'll get a chance to, to meet back here again. Of course, we do so here. Thank you very much, Jimmy Fung. Until next time, good night at the Garden of New York City.